Let's learn how to set the video mode, that is resolution and frame rate, using a property node, then also how to determine the available video modes with NIMAX for your particular webcam. Here I have my webcam connected to my Rio USB port. In this video processing application, I have the webcam image and the processed image displayed. Looking at the block diagram, I have my initial setup and initialization. Here I'm capturing the image, converting it to gray level, and then detecting edges inside the while loop. And then when you break out of the while loop, have some shutdown activities by way of closing the camera and freeing up the space from iMac Create. In between Configure Grab and the Session Selector, that is Cam Zero, I need to insert a couple items. Let's look under Vision and Motion. I'll begin with iMac DX, grab the Property node. Property node needs a reference in, and then it produces a reference out. That will be associated with the camera session ID. I also need iMac DX open camera. That's going to go between these two. What I'm doing here is opening a session to the particular webcam, connecting that up to the property node. Notice that when you establish that connection, then it becomes specific to iMac DX type session. Now I'll select the particular property and I'm looking at acquisition attributes and then video mode. You see that's an integer data type. Change that to a write mode and then create a front panel control. Now the video modes are specified as numerical values. So we would say video mode 0, 1, 2, 3, etc. Let's see what video mode 3 looks like. All right, we see that the image resolution is considerably smaller than before. We see that the processing rate is a lot faster than before. So There's an advantage of using lower resolution sometimes. Now, if you'd like to experiment with a different video mode, you have to stop the VI and then start over because this is part of the initialization that happens before going into the while loop. Here's video mode four. This is even slightly less resolution, 160 by 120. Now, instead of just guessing and checking at those video mode numbers, you can go into NIMAX and discover the available video modes for your particular webcam. I'll start up the Measurement and Automation Explorer, or NIMAX for short. Do Remote Systems, select the My Rio, select Devices and Interfaces. And when you have a webcam attached, you will see iMac DX devices appear here as well. So I'll click on Cam Zero. By the way, you can snap a single image or you can set up a grab as well. This way you could make some adjustments and kind of see things while you're still inside NIMAX. That's kind of handy. Here you have some camera information. And you can find your webcam video modes under Acquisition Attributes. Now this pull-down list will vary depending on the particular webcam that you have attached. The one that I have attached has five modes altogether, numbered 0 to 4. Now according to this list, I get 352 by 288 pixels from mode 1. We stop the grab inside NIMAX. Let's try video mode one back in the VI. Just make sure that we actually get 352 by 288. Sure enough, that worked. 
So again, use NIMAX to find out the capabilities for your particular camera.